creating 3D maps and notations. Let's assume that during the model control, you found some problems with design. Let's hide these two cubes. To activate markups, make a right click over the working panel and press our markups. In order to begin, let's open viewpoints. Go to the navigator and activate viewpoints. Each and every time you will create a markup in Synchro, it will create a new viewpoint. Let's enable markup. Click over the pencil. Now you have plenty of choice. You can draw a line mockup, a polyline, rectangular, circle, or freehand markup, along with adding some nodes, arrows, or clouds. Let's select a cloud. And let's draw a cloud. Upon the completion, Synchro will ask you to name it. Let's say And we will include in this viewpoint the camera position, the focus time on the Gantt chart, and 3D view properties, which can be also adjustable from here. So we will include all this to our viewpoint. Let's press OK. Now we can go ahead and add some node markup. Place over anywhere on the roof, and let's write divide the roof with expansion joints. We can draw an arrow. And now we need to deactivate the markup edit mode. Disable the markup and by scrolling out or in the markup will disappear. To activate or to view the markups simply select the viewpoint and click Activate in Selected Tree View. You can read some general information like name, description, you can attach some URL, and as well, these mockups can be deleted. You can right click over the viewpoint, you can rename it, delete it, duplicate, activate in all or selected 3D view, or extract it as an image by adjusting the 3D view settings and the image file path, you can extract this image from Synchron. 